position again the hands um, in a neutral position on the side you're gonna get the joint to zero now if they have anything going wrong with the wrist again you're going off the carpal bone here so if they're contracted here and you can't get the wrist just know that this this might be too long and it might pop off of it a little bit that's okay okay just making sure that you're keeping this in line with the phalangeal proximal and distal okay and then coming straight down, down. okay um, extension you can flip these over so again you're going to stabilize uh, below pressure comes from above and you're going to come up here this is a little firm end feel because of the joint capsule here so you can again go along the palmar side right over the joint proximal distal stabilization and then you'll go here looking straight down now these if you haven't used them they they're not specific they go in fives so if it's in between there again it's kind of a guesstimate um, but you can also use these if you want even on um, extension here it's a little for me it's a little harder to hold this in position like for me it kind of because you're holding the the hand in position this in position and then coming up this way and again making sure that your your uh, pressure is coming from the most proximal so you can you can use both on there see which ones you like um, so you can do extension that way either on the top with this or on the bottom with this okay during practicals i don't care you just pick which one but again it's best to practice because you don't know what each clinic has